What's up everybody? In this one we're gonna explore the differences between a distributor and a wholesaler. Let's get into it. To best explain the differences between a distributor and a wholesaler, let's first take a glance at the supply chain as a whole. The supply chain is the system used to get products from manufacturer to the customer. The supply chain includes manufacturers, distributors, wholesalers, retailers, and customers. First come the manufacturers. They are the companies manufacturing or making the products themselves. They're usually very large companies and only sell to distributors or wholesalers in order to sell their products. Next are the distributors. They will usually enter into contracts with the manufacturers and are involved with selling to various businesses and customers throughout the entire market. The wholesaler is a company that buys in bulk and sells these products in smaller units to retailers and small businesses. Retailers are the storefronts, grocery stores, and small mom and pop shops that customers go to and purchase their products. So what are the key differences between a distributor and a wholesaler? The distributor will enter into contracts with the manufacturer, often limiting the products they can carry, and they will then distribute or sell these products to wholesalers, retailers, or even customers. Wholesalers will not enter into contracts with the manufacturer and is free to carry a larger variety of products. They will then resell these products in smaller units to retail outlets and small businesses. You see, most wholesalers won't sell retail to individual customers, with a few exceptions like BJ's Wholesale or Sam's Club. Well, that's about it, guys. We're going to go ahead and wrap this video up here. Hope you all found it helpful. If you did, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. It'll really help us out. See you in the next one.